Hello, it's Brennan Moriarty, and uh, got my little book. It's got a little string on it, but uh, it's not quite long enough. It's, it's a string, though, and so that's amazing, right? Amazing. It's like moonbeams and starlight just behind that building up there. Stars are lining up into the west, into the east where the sun rises. Tonight, special. The train comes. Oh, God. It is a secret society. Don't tell anybody. We must gather the stardust. So, um, what I've, what I've, uh, I've recorded some, uh, I'm recording. <laughs> and, uh, vegetarian food for me, yes, pretty much, mostly. That helps a lot. Um, not all today, so it's, I don't know what to do. So, um, yeah, the, uh, the stardust, I wrote, I drew this little picture today, copied off a wall I saw, this was, a there was a chameleon on one side, and two lizards on the other side, and I tried to draw this picture, I saw, that is a cool, that is one cool, he had a longer face than that, much longer, he had a very long, sad face, and eyes wide, and this, uh, sort of thing coming over, and, and so I was really fascinated. I figured that's that's just you know, went down uh, some some uh, this alley down by Harry Potter, don't you know? And um, got up a little late. And uh, but um, um, yeah. So uh, so I was just taking notes and counting trains coming in the station. And uh, and I climbed a Norman Tower today. And um, E.T. Crooked Finger. I don't know. <laughs> this, is, this is supposed to be, but um, I try to be right, you know. I'm very flexible. Um, ambidextro minded. Ambo, ambo ast astro dextro minded. And um, Logic Lane. I wrote this, wrote this in Logic Lane behind the gate. Kind of uh, putting it uh, behind the gate as I was. Uh, I don't even know how this thing works here, but Logic Lane. So I was um, Starlight Express, and it's happening. Okay, it is happening. The Star King, and uh, I don't know, something like that. Um, I just ate, so I'm kind of excited. This happens, and um, I got a new shirt. Check it out. Yeah, I got I got a purple one too, and. Uh, I was going to get the robe, but um, that's like hundreds of dollars. It probably weighs a couple pounds as well. So, <laughs> uh, so uh, I'm, uh, yeah, I just ate, so, so it's, it's no good, but, <laughs> you know, uh, I'm just, um, I'm blabbering, I guess, because I just ate, and so that's, that's how it happens, right? You Respond, your your wisdom is is of hunger, and um, so basically, I'm waiting for the storm. But the storm can the storm can wait. Uh, uh, I'll probably go out west. I guess. I guess I will. I will. I will. I guess. And um, I don't know. Uh, I, I got this book. Ah, the backpack. Do you quantum think? So I bought this at the airport, uh, and um, you know, the world is changing at a dizzying pace. We're all looking for new ways of thinking that can bring about real solutions to modern problems from the pursuit of inner serenity, serenity to solving world conflicts. In Do You Quantum Think, author Diane Collins shares her ingenious discovery that reveals critical missing link to make sense of our changing times. Her discovery provides us with an understanding and methodology to rise above problems of today by laying the foundation for an entirely new way to think. Part science, part philosophy, part spirituality. Where am I? Do You Quantum Think draws on a wide spectrum of sources from cutting-edge innovations in the sciences to the, to the insights of the world's greatest spiritual leaders. This book will make you 
This book will make you laugh, free you from limiting ideas, and introduce you to a to the world most to the world's introduce you to the most advanced principles and practical method methods for living. Do you quantum think will rock your world in the best ways? As you experience one revelation after another, now I I've, I've been doing this for quite a while myself, but I'm just excited that the trains are actually leaving the station on the Starlight Express. <laughs> I just heard this story today. And I just love it. You know, it's a uh, when you that's a loud train. Um, the train is is leaving. Maybe it's coming. I don't know if it's coming or going. I, I cannot see the train. So, anyways, uh, th this book is, is really fascinating. The wisdom put forth in this unparalleled work arrives at a critical juncture at the start of the 21st century, just as we are witnessing a revolution in technology. So society itself is also undergoing a far more profound collective transformation. This transformation is nothing less than rev the revolution of consciousness itself. Our own minds and awareness, the missing of do you, the mission of do you quantum think is to help us understand the meaning and the benefit of this vastly important process. More importantly, the book gives us a, a way there, a personal experience of a quantum leap in our thinking that is as exhilarating and rewarding as it is illuminating. Do you quantum think shows how an old world view has conditioned the way we think and thus conditioned our responses. It dispels the myth of choice by hitting us with the realization that although we imagine we think and choose we imagine we think and choose freely, this belief is in fact an illusion. We begin to understand that our beliefs and institutions have been shaped by a seventeenth century industrial age reality that is now hopelessly outdated. Uh, Diane Collins reveals how this old world view thinking is limited, limiting our relationships, our approaches to problem solving, and how we as a community deal with collective issues such as environment, politics, and health. She has introduced, she then introduces us to quantum think, a new system of thinking that breaks us free of old limits as we integrate the wisdom of cutting-edge science, sci cutting-edge scientific principles and timeless natural laws into daily life. It is new thinking that has the power to change the course of human destiny. Until now, the idea died. Until now, the idea thought creates reality has given little attention outside the so-called New Thought movement. Dismissed as wishful thinking and having little to do with concrete reality since the dawn, since concrete reality, since, <laughs> sorry, I'm dyslexic, <laughs> I want to read backwards, see, that would be nice. Okay, um, since the dawn of human civilization, sages and spiritual masters have taught, as you think, so you become. But it is only now that the realistic scientific evidence for this has emerged. The implications of this growing awareness help to form the foundation of the quantum think message. Though science may, in, though, though science may infer the undeniable real evidence is your own experience, do you quantum think presents facts and offers prescriptive advice? <clears throat> Not as another how-to book, how-to book, but as an actual methodology that reveals its message to you directly by the validity of your own experience. The Quantum Think system offers 21 simple yet profound pr principles and practices that will expand your mind, lift your spirit, and satisfy your soul. More than a book to be read and placed on the shelf, do you Quantum Think is a companion resource intended for each of us to tap into our own unique wisdom and apply it. <clears throat> As Diane Collins says, not just know the wisdom, but live it. Once in a while, a book comes out that can change the course of humanity for the better. This is such a book. As we find ourselves... <clears throat> 
leg up. <laughs> As we find ourselves, where am I? I can't find myself. I don't even know where I am. Uh, <clears throat> let me start. Once in a while, a book comes out that can. <clears throat> a train goes by. Once in a while, a train goes by. Uh, <laughs> hold on, the train's passing. It's the it's Starlight Express. Do not tell anyone the. 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 Um, the woman of the haystack is upon the train. The Orungman, uh, the lamplighter, that's, that's probably me. <laughs> Somewhere, the little winds will find us. Uh, bad notes, bad, ra bad radio listening. Okay, so listen now. <clears throat> once in a while, a book comes... <clears throat> okay. Once in a while, a book comes out that can change the course of humanity for the better. This is such a book. We find ourselves encountering unprecedented reality-altering change. Do You Quantum Think arrives to present a un universal big picture <clears throat> as it relates to you, not for the sake of mere learning, but for the sake of learning masterfully. So this, this book, Do You Quantum Think, caught my eye, and I'm like, okay. <laughs> I don't know what to buy a lot of times. Uh, clothing, food, a complete you know, health. Uh, clueless, okay? This loincloth and whatever's laying on the table I gotta eat, right? That's sound if it's on the table, boy, that's nice. So <clears throat> this book is this book is just really fascinating and um <clears throat> I don't know, uh maybe 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 if I do this, you know, I'm like <laughs> slow motion. Whoa So uh <clears throat> yeah I'm kinda um okay now I will do some calisthenics. So That's my radio. So, I got my radio, got a couple of them, that's the, the beauty. After a long and lonely vigil. What they're talking about. I just read between the lines. Crazy world, crazy world, and uh, I guess I'm uh, tuned in, and uh, not 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 enough. I gotta hold the thing up to my ear till I get an ear infection. You know, so. no headphones, but um, because I have problems with my neck and my ears and everything. So, uh, it's like eating. God, God, a little sip of coffee, that's, not even that, I had two cups of decaf today, so maybe that's, that's what's wrong. So I climbed the, the Norman Tower, I climbed Carfax Tower and the Norman Tower, but I climbed Carfax Tower first, I said, oh, you were here earlier this week, so come on, just go on, and, and then I uh, walked around and around and around, it was like Harry Potter, you know, uh, I was, and through the, through the botanical gardens, the greenhouse, uh, um, it's one church with a restaurant in the back. That was, that was pretty cool. And, um... No stranger to the problems having that's me. Just walking down with a radio down this road. So, uh, I hope that, uh, book was, um... When you master your mind, you master your life. That is it. And that is the gift of geography and culture. Okay? That is the empath of geography and culture that must... You cannot wish, you know, you cannot choose this. You have, you have to actually make it happen. It has to, uh, it's a statistic, okay? It's a code, okay? You have to, you have to crack this code and, okay, the radio is getting vulgar. Um, so this is the, this is the code that I'm working on, okay? Uh, I've been working on it for so long that I, I think I have it and then, you know, my poetry is just, you know, sometimes, sometimes I read it again. Like, I, I, I put pure logic into my poetry, 
But when I read it again, sometimes I'm kind of like, oh, I'm too tired to read this. And the screen goes blank. So, um, so but <laughs> it is pure logic. It is pure stardust that the, <laughs> I don't know, <laughs> you know, um, I'm, I'm, I'm floundering, but um, I, I'm doing, you know, I'm trying to be the God, you know, that bring God to earth and the angels to heaven, okay? That is really important. God can't stay up there, and the angels cannot suffer down there, and, and you know where, geography. So this is, uh, so, you know, this is... This is the one. Oh, now I'll do some dropping. Oh, ball. He goes for the ball. And he wins. He gets in there. He goes in. Might be, I think I'm getting old sometimes when I miss my, uh, miss my snack or miss my dinner or something like that. I just uh, miss, miss my nap. That's it. But um, temporary sort of uh, insanity, you know, temp temporary, uh, perfect world. That's, that's, that's going to be the, the reaction to the action of a net, the, the cross. Yeah. Comes up goes down here it's on the it's on the balance beam everything is balanced and then they go back in go, there's a net comes up it's like a, a, a tower a funnel a funnel of goodness comes down and funnels funnels goodness down and x goes through the hoop and it's like going out of hell and into heaven and y <laughs> i guess it's y x and y there is no z z z is in hell okay but these are these are conquering health. These 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 geographies in general happiness. They are they are marching, and they need they need peaceful orders. They need they need the orders to be absolutely peaceful, to be successful in humanity. The, the dawn that ends the magic. We must we must complete the magic tonight. And the stars are indeed, uh, they do that stuff, you know, they, they, um, they rise and the sun rises and scorches the earth. And so you must be, you must have, you must have delivered the stardust on time. Um, oh, and I went to, uh, cafe the oldest cafe in the in, in the world today had a coffee there it was pretty good decaf thank you um at 243 i went to the oldest castle across the street from queen's lane or something like that so it was pretty cool i got my little bug this is all i really need but uh this, this little string you have to pull it but gently you have to pull the string gently and you must tie it to the earth so that the angels can climb up and it has to be a, it's a quantified the balance beam okay so this is you know the beam and it comes up and it's like this this cruci this uh you know it's a cross it's you know the crossroads of the world and and there's the ends of the world way up there like the cross comes from europe and america is here the, the great divide and the cross comes through, and it only just barely, you know, it's like engineering, like, oh, we want stuff, but it's all, actually, all these ones, and no one needs more than the internet. And the nations, they don't really, they don't really penetrate that on the five points of humanity. Um, so, and please, someone edited this stuff, because I know the first five minutes is, like, me digesting or something, burping or something, that's kind of vulgar. I'm just trying to... Uh, I'm doing. I'm doing. Okay. Hey, hey. 